Hi you guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about the fragrances that celebrities wear. So if this is your first time, I am Sophisticated Lady and thank you for joining. Please like and subscribe. And if it's not your first time, then um, welcome back. So that's what I'm going to be talking about. So if you're interested, then um, continue to watch. Hi guys and thank you for coming back. First off we have LeBron James. So LeBron wears Dolce and Gabbana the one. That is for LeBron. Next we have Will Smith and Will Smith. He likes to wear Vera Wang for me. I'm sure it smells delicious. Next we have my Jay-Z, Jay-Z. And Jay-Z wears um, Melissa by Creed. Very expensive. So some of these are a real surprise because I thought, I would think that um, they would spend more money on their perfumes and their colognes, but I guess it's not all about the money, it's just about the fragrance and how it makes you feel. Um, but um, I think I said um, Jay-Z's fragrance name wrong is uh, Millicene. Millicene. It's Millicene Imperial. So um, that means more um, oil in the perfume than uh, we're normally used to. So just wanted to share that with you. <laughs> Next we have Beyonce. Oh, I'll sing the ladies. I'll sing the ladies. <laughs> anyway, uh, Beyonce wears Armani Diamonds. And Nicki Minaj. And Nicki Minaj wears Chloe. The classic Chloe. And so that is actual real silver on the bottle top. Next we have uh, Lil Wayne, Lil Wayne, Lil Wayne says Mark Jacobs Bang, you know like bang, bang, bang. Remember he used to be with uh, the boys on the block when the block was hot. You know Birdman, all that. And then we have Drake and Drake Rocks, a fragrance by Clive Christian. And this one is really pricey. I've never heard of it, but I do love the packaging. So Drake's um, cologne is about $1,700 for a 100 ml bottle. And Jay-Z's um, fragrance, Millicimi Imperial, is $415 for so I don't think that's that bad for a billionaire. <laughs> what you think? <laughs> Next we have Playboy Cardi, and he likes to wear YSL La Nuit. This is a very popular scent uh, with the celebrities. I see it all the time in different places, um, even Kanye, which is next. Up. He likes to rock YSL. La Nuit also. I'm sure he has plenty of other colognes too. Next we have Cristiano Ronaldo. He likes to wear Pie by Givenchy. Givenchy. And then we have Michael Jordan. And if I have my own fragrance, I will rock my own fragrance. And that is exactly what Michael Jordan does. Favorite, favorite, nasty Nas. Nasty Nas. <laughs> nasty Nas. He likes to rock Tom Ford Tobacco Vanille. That's a popular fragrance, also. Then we have YG Faux Honey. And he likes to rock Chanel Blue. Blue Chanel. This is that Mrs. Mimi. 
Leaks. And Miss Nene Leaks rocks. Joe Malone, Nectarine. Rock, rock, rock. That body looks rock hard, huh? I know. But he rocks um, Kenzo home. I'm going to think he needs to step his game up. Just a smidgen on that, if I'm not mistaken. And then we got this girl. I remember what she said, y'all. Camilla Cabello. She rocks Chanel. Number five. I heard what you said. Zane Malik likes to rock Dolce & Gabbana, light blue. Light blue. Next we have Chrissy Teigen. She is a happy John Legend. And she likes to rock Dior Hypnotic Poison Fragrance. I think it's like about 50 bucks. And then we got two chains, two chains. And two chain rocks bond number nine Sutton Place. He even put it in one of his songs. And next we have Haley Bieber, Justin Bieber's wife. And Miss Girl likes to rock bond number nine West Side. And then we have Ariana Grande. Miss Ariana Grande. <laughs> she likes to rock Tom Ford. Neroli, Portofino, Aqua. And then we got our favorite sister girl, Miss Riri. Hey, Riri. She rocks Love, Don't Be Shy by Killian. Or just Love by Killian. And then we have Gigi Hadi. Miss Gigi. Miss Gigi rocks Tom Ford, Velvet Orchid. It's a strong scent. You don't need much, but I like it. Next up, we have Boosie. Yes. A-Z-Z. And he rocks his own fragrance like Michael Jordan. Dangerous by Boosie. And then we have Miss Cardi B. Press, 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 press. She is in love with White Diamonds by Elizabeth Taylor because that was her grandmother's favorite scent. R.I.P. to her Grammy. And then we got Tina Jenner. And I know that she did something with Esther Lauder, so I guess she's stepping in for this I assume it smells delicious because I love this a lot. And then we got Mr. Fine Bread. <laughs> Mr. Bread Cooper. He wears Aqua de Parma. I've never smelled that one. Then we got our favorite. The sophisticated lady. <laughs> you know, I can't leave myself out. So I rock Miss Dior. Rose and Roses for one, but my favorite is Shag Hop Oud by Swiss Arabian. And my next purchase will be Velvet Rose by Joe Malone. So anyway, thank you for watching and I will um, see you in the next one.